into tasty bites, <laughs> recipes you'd be a fool not to try. <laughs> Today we start with a chervil aioli, a dipping <laughs> sauce in the mayonnaise family. <laughs> this sauce comes from our dear friend, Wisteria McGrill. <laughs> Let's begin. There is no greater purpose for a freshly laid egg than an aioli or a mayonnaise. Olive oil is particularly good in this recipe, but only if you whisk it by hand. If you want to use an immersion blender, try sunflower or some other oil. Cutting olive oil with metal blades tends to turn it bitter and sad. <laughs> now, take one farm fresh egg from a happy-go-lucky, 100% organic, pasture-raised uh, chicken. Do not use conventional factory-farmed eggs with this or <laughs> Bring this up to room temperature. <laughs> now, separate the egg yolk from the white and reserve that for another use. A small clove of garlic and mash it very carefully. <laughs> you want to be gentle to bring out the true flavor. <laughs> Add this to your egg yolk with half a cup of your olive oil and whisk briskly by hand until a well incorporated. <laughs> it might overpower the flavor. <laughs> now, add, uh, add salt to taste. Add the remaining olive oil in a thin, thin stream. <laughs> and last, but certainly not least, this uh, aioli. You want to add half a teaspoon of fresh, finely chopped <laughs> Chervil. Chervil. C H E R V I L. Chervil. <laughs> now, once your uh, mixture is all finished, you can serve it, and you should serve it immediately. Uh, perhaps for overall, or lightly seamed vegetables, such as carrots, or radishes, or carbuna, or perhaps on a cracker, such as a uh, water cracker, or a uh, rinse cracker, or a uh, saltine cracker, or some matcha cracker, or a Jewish cracker. <laughs> It's rather like mayonnaise. <laughs> <laughs> That's all the time we have for today's episode. Stay tuned for the Gunslinger Hour next. And remember to always put your best food forward. <laughs>